If we haven't met before, my name is Dee. So today in typeset.com, we're going to learn how to use AI mode to create titles, subtitles and body text for your new creation. Now, if you haven't yet tried typeset, all you need to do is go to typeset.com and you can sign up for a free trial. Now the AI mode can certainly help you save time by auto-generating content, which is great, but I would highly recommend that you do a couple of things with this content before posting or publishing your creation. So let's jump into presentation mode for a moment. On the right hand side, you'll see this pink play button. Click on that to be taken into presentation mode. Okay, so unlocking the power of AI, top tips for success. So first of all, you should always write in your own voice. If the wording isn't something that you would generally say, then you need to change it up. There are a lot of people out there using AI generated content to write their posts, but much of it can appear robotic with no emotion or personality. So don't forget to humanize your content. You should always check for plagiarism. You don't want to publish anything that could be copied from somewhere else. Plagiarism is a big no-no. It can ruin your reputation and ruin your business. Fact checking is also very important. Some AI creators cite sources and references. I would always check them to ensure the info provided is factual and true. So remember, anything AI generated is created by a machine. This machine sources the content from the internet, and as you know, not everything online is true or factual. So, how to use AI mode to create titles, subtitles, and body text. So, I'll step off my high horse now and show you how to generate great titles and content using the AI tool here in typeset.com. Okay, so first of all, you need to create a new page. The easiest way to do that is to press enter on your keyboard three times. And straight away, I am in a new page. The other option, of course, is to click on the gear icon on the far left. This also gives you the chance to duplicate a page or even delete a page. All right, so I have a new tile here. I'm going to start right here. So how to use AI to create a title. So first of all, ensure you are in title mode at the top here. So clicking on this here will take you to title, subtitle or normal. We want to be in title mode. You can also click on the plus sign here and ensure that you're in title mode as well. Next, forward slash on your computer keyboard and then press enter. As you'll see, AI mode is the one currently selected. We are now in AI mode. So I'm going to create a title for a poem about typeset. So I've typed it into the AI mode. All I need to do is press enter and the little robot will start doing its thing. So you'll be given some options. All you need to do now is click through on the arrows below the options to see each one. So the first one is typeset your way to poetic perfection. Not bad. Typeset the key to unlocking poetic possibilities. And then typeset unleashing the power of poetry. You'll only get three options at this stage. Choose which one you like. And I'm just going to choose this one. I can either click on the button here or just press enter and that will be entered onto my new tile. I'm just going to change the background of this tile by clicking on the magic wand on the tile. And I'm just going to use this one, which is the centered with a white background. All right, so I am in the next page and I'm wanting to use the little robot to create a poem about typeset. Now, in this case, I need to ensure I am in normal mode, which is body mode. 
again forward slash. I'm going to type in uh, right about, like enter right about typeset.com in a rhyming poem. And then press enter and we'll see what we get. First, I will ensure that I'm spelling it rhyming correctly. I think that's how you spell it. And enter. All right, so here we have a response. Typeset.com is a great tool for all of your design and writing rules. It'll help you create a masterpiece and make your writing look its best. The templates are so easy to use, just pick one and you'll be sure to choose. Your document will look so neat and you won't have to compete to make it look like the rest. Uh, it's not bad, it could be better, but I'm just going to save that for now. And that is now entered as my body text in a new page. Now, if I want to separate this into uh, two pages, so say one, two, three, four, five, make it four, first four lines on one page and then the remainder on a second page. I'm going to press enter three times. And there we go, we've got them separated into two pages. Now I can also make some changes to each of these pages. All I need to do is click again on the magic wand and I can change the design of each of those files or pages. Click on it again and closes this. I can also click on the little gear icon on the page on the left and I may actually center it. I think it might look a little better if it's centered. So I need to center each line individually. Again, clicking on the gear icon for each line and centering the wording. So going back to the first page, we'll center each line there as well. And there we go. So we've got our title and we've got our body text with our little rhyme. Now, this rhyme isn't as good as I'd hoped. I did run a little experiment um, earlier today. So I'm just going to go back into presentation mode or preview mode to take a look at the one when I was testing earlier today. Experience typesets a rhyming delight. Typeset is a tool that's quite sublime. It's a great way to make your writing shine. It's got features that will make your work look great. It'll save you time and not make you wait. It's got templates to help you get it right. And it's easy to use, no need to fight. It's the perfect way to make your writing look neat. And with Typeset, you can't be beat. So if you have found this tutorial helpful, you can test out Typeset with a free trial. Simply go to typeset.com and check it out. Thanks so much for watching and be sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials on Typeset.